recruiting trail Aggie head coach Jimbo Fisher and company are putting in serious work. In the last two weeks, a has gained three verbal commitments from the 2021 class. a and though, did not win the recruiting battle for 2020 running back Zach Evans, the North Shore product and five-star prospect has signed financial aid paperwork with TCU. Man, here in the Brazos Valley, we had a massive 2020 signing class. And as Mike Lucas reports, former a and Consolidated star Nate Floyd is hoping to make an immediate impact as a true freshman at Texas Tech. If you've watched any of ESPN's The Last Dance, it's pretty obvious no one was more competitive than Michael Jordan. He would make things up about his opponents just to give himself an edge, and that competitive drive is what elevated him to another level of greatness. It's too early to tell if our local Brazos Valley stars are destined for greatness in that sense, but it is easy to see who has competition sewn into their DNA. While some people may be taking their time on quarantine to relax, former A&M Consolidated star and Texas Tech commit Nate Floyd is doing the exact opposite. He's putting his head down and grinding to get better every day because the Red Raiders coaching staff says the best DBs will see the field this year, regardless of their class. Like I said earlier with the haters, I mean, people going to say he's too slow or he's too small. I just add that and use those uh things as fuel to my fire and yeah hopefully I can compete and get that earned. I mean that starting spot. Sounds a little Jordan-esque if you ask me. Coming up tonight at 10 more from my conversation with Floyd including the one skill that separates him from other defensive backs in this class. Justin. Thanks Mike.